Hi, I'm Steve Southwell, editor of Whosplan.com. One of my pet peeves is when politicians use fear to manufacture controversy. One of the latest ones, it's actually been going on a couple years with some of the more ignorant politicians, has to do with these compact fluorescent light bulbs. You see, each of these bulbs, just like every fluorescent light, the tubes, the four foot, eight foot, two foot tubes you might have in fixtures in your home, they each have a tiny amount of mercury in them. So the fear factor is, oh my God, what happens if you break one of these? So I just figured I've got some old ones here that, that are no longer any good in my house. I'm going to break one and just kind of show you what's inside it. Now what I've done is I've got it in a, a plastic Ziploc bag and the reason for that is I want, I want all the pieces to stay with me because I want to show you what's in it. I've broken these before and um, I think I've had two of them break by accident in the 15 years that I've been using them. So I'm going to just take this plastic bag and put a little uh, cloth over it, grab a hammer and let's just go ahead and smash it. Oh, let's see. Yeah, there we go. So let's take a look here. See if we can zoom in on any of that. As you can see, there's just not any liquid mercury to speak of in here. It's just basically powder. It's the same old powder that fluorescent light fixtures have had forever. Now I'm sure there's a tiny amount, just because we don't see it doesn't mean it's not there. It is there. There's just not very much of it. So let's talk about what I just did here. How much mercury do these bulbs actually have in them? Well, according to the federal government Energy Star program, the average bulb has four milligrams. That is 0 0.004 grams of mercury. How much is a gram? Gram is about the weight of a paper clip, right? That's not very much mercury. It's certainly nothing to evacuate your house over, freak out about, and it's definitely not anything that you need to start using wasteful old-fashioned light bulbs for. Go ahead and use these just don't play hockey in the house and when you're done with them don't throw them out and don't smash them like I just did take these things put them in a bag take them with you to Home Depot turn them in a lot of places like that will take them for free they'll take them and recycle them just to give you some perspective on how much mercury that was I have a bottle of mercury here which I probably shouldn't have it's not safe to have around but I've had this for years and I really need to recycle it but this, this is a bottle of mercury. Um, got some out of some, um, some blood pressure um, cuffs that were in an old uh, medical office that I had to wreck. Um, and I think uh, they used to have in, in gun cleaning kits, people used to keep mercury around um, to clean their guns. Anyhow, the mercury in here is enough for 816,000 CF light bulbs. 816,000 light bulbs just with this amount of mercury. So again, no need to freak out. And not only that, but I think you should wonder about anyone who would ask you to freak out over that much mercury. Now, granted, if, if this was a light bulb factory and I was in here every day working with this stuff and, and breaking them all the time, then maybe I'd be a little concerned because it would become an occupational hazard. But as it is, I'm not worried. I'm not worried, neither should you. Go ahead and save the money, buy these light bulbs, and you'll actually result in less mercury going into the environment. The reason for that is that when coal burning power plants burn coal, they burn mercury which goes into the air. Now that combines with rainwater and goes into the lake and forms methyl mercury, which your fish eat and when you eat those fish then it it gets in you so that's not a good thing we don't want mercury in the environment so the best way to do that is to use less electricity and one of the easiest ways to use less electricity is by using compact fluorescent bulbs 
They're really good nowadays. They turn on almost instantly. They have a nice warm light that you're going to like. Use them. They're good for you.